Well, hey, Mike, how's it going? We just wanted to take a chance and say thank you. Thank you for all the work that you've done with students. Thank you for your heart. Thank you for all the difference that you've made in your time working at Walnut Hill. Uh, and I just want to say thank you myself. Uh, it, it has been great to be your friend. It has been great to get to work alongside you. It's been an honor, man. I, I love your heart for people. I love your creativity and your ability to see things in a way that just that matters. Uh, and so I'm looking forward to seeing how that's used as you head into the school system and as you work on things uh, around your house and connecting to people. It's going to be really exciting to see what God does. We love you, man. Hey, Mike. So after knowing you for 10 years, I can finally say you're pretty all right. You're a pretty all right guy. Um, but no, I wanted to thank you so much for your friendship, your mentorship, your guidance. Um, your pastoral care. Um, you have really impacted my life for the better and I just thank you for walking with me, helping me understand my purpose in Christ, helping me to walk in the authority of the Holy Spirit and really just walking in the fullness of who God made hey, me. Mike, um, I just wanted to say thank you so much. You know, I mean, you've been such a positive influence on my life and my crew. I love our small group discussions. They mean so much to me. And, you know, you just, You've really changed my life. You know I mean, you've given me a new perspective on the Bible, how it is to be a Christian, and opened up plenty of new topics for me to explore in my faith. And I just want to say thank you and happy Mike Day. Mike, I'm going to use pictures to show how much you've made an impact on me. Uh, most people, when they share truth and they inject that truth, they kind of think of this little needle here. Nobody likes it sometimes, right? Some people are afraid of it, but you deliver medicine of hope and healing and spiritual life when you share God's word. Um, but this is most people. This is a reflection of you. You don't know how to do anything but going deep. And you give so much hope and healing and truth that gets not just to the surface level of who somebody is, but to the very heart of who God designed them to be. And I am forever grateful, and you will never know, this side of heaven, how much you have done for me and for all of the youth that you have worked with and have invested in by going deep with the love and truth of God's word. Thank you. Hey, Mike. Um, me and Dean wanted to thank you for all that you've done for us in the youth group. Um, you've really helped me um, grow into my faith. Um, you prayed over me when uh, I was baptized and you just mean so much to me and I'm so sad to see you go. We'll miss your deep talks in our small group on the topic or whatever we were talking about. Hey Mike, just wanted to take a second and thank you for everything that you've done for Walnut Hill, including what you've done for me in my own faith walk. Looking back over the years, I think it really began with you marrying Jamie and I, along with Greg Flower, and that was six years ago, I think. Uh, hopefully Jamie isn't watching right now, but yeah, I think it was six years ago uh, where you, you know, signed the paperwork and was part of that ceremony of marrying Jamie and I. So um, yeah, just over the last couple of years specifically, you've always been a, uh, what I see as a mentor to me, where you've, uh, you've allowed me to bounce questions off you and um, you've challenged me in many ways with who I was listening to and theology and and I've really uh, come to to enjoy that and like those conversations that I've had with you um, even on Tuesday nights you you coming down to the cafe where I've been doing work and just coming to say hi so I've really appreciated the the friendship over the years and I hope it continues uh, so enjoy your night. I'm looking forward to see how God uses you in the future. Talk to you soon. Bye. Hey, Mike, it's Declan. I want to say thank you for all you've done for this youth group, for our small group. Um, I'm really going to miss you. I'm really going to miss your sermons. I'm going to miss your Crocs. Uh, I wish you the best of luck in whatever God has planned for you next. Uh, and thank you for all you have done. Hey, Mike, Craig here. Just wanted to send you out with a message, my man. I know... Tuesday, it's your last time with the youth. Hopefully, you're going to be bringing fire when you talk. And uh, just want to thank you for the many years of service with Warner Hill. We appreciate you, brother. Uh, I'm going to miss you. Hopefully, you're not going to be a stranger. I know you have a busy, a busy plate. And uh, I trust the Lord He's going to use you in all the areas that He's called you. And uh, just thanks again for being a part of Warner Hill and for teaching and leading our youth. Uh, 
Hope to see you soon, brother. Go well. Hey, Mike. Just want to say how much I love you and everything you've done for the youth group. And, you know, I figured there was no better way than to say it than to, like, come to your house, you know, and spread my love for you and just tell everyone how much I love you and how much I'm going to miss you and how great you are. So, yeah, thanks for all you do, Mike. Hey Mike, I just wanted to say I've had a great time over the past few weeks getting to lead with you. And uh, I love how you inspire the students and challenge them to think deeper. And of course, the random conversations about brain chemistry. Uh, even though I've known you only for a short period of time, you've inspired me to be a better and more thoughtful leader. You'll be greatly missed and uh, thanks for everything you've done. Hey Mike, it's Lance now. And you just heard from just a fraction of the people that you've impacted here at Walnut Hill. So I'm, uh, I'm so thankful that you're here. And when I first started here uh, just over a year ago, one of the things I was most excited about, honestly, man, is that I was gonna be working with you. And I've told you that privately, but I thought it's worth saying publicly here also. So man, thank you so much for everything you've done at Walnut Hill. Thank you for being here during this time of transition uh, and welcoming me here, man. And uh, you know, I really value our friendship. And one of the things I appreciated about you is that you're not just a surface level friend. Like you always want to like dig deeper and, and dive into friendships and start talking about things that actually matter. And I think that's a, a really important thing when it comes to friends. So thank you for all you've done. I'm thrilled that you're not leaving Walnut Hill and you're not leaving the area and you're still going to be around. Um, but it's great that you're going to be able to look back here at Walnut Hill and just see the impact that you've made. So, man, I appreciate you. I'm going to miss you on Sunday mornings and during the midweek youth groups. But I'm really glad that we get to stay friends. All right, man, I will talk to you soon. Thanks for being here, bud.